Hi guys, it's Chris calling. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are in the world. Hello and welcome back to my channel. If you guys have returned since my last video, then thank you very much. And if you guys are new here, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button and make sure that your notifications are switched on so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. Now hold your horses guys, because in today's video, I'm gonna be reacting to the top 20 most streamed Eurovision songs ever on Spotify. This is right up to the Year 2023. Some Eurovision songs don't actually do as well in the contest. They might come middle of the board or even bottom of the board, but then following the contest in the coming weeks, they can build their way up the Spotify chart. Now, this has been the case for a lot of songs since the contest began in 1956. So we're going to dive straight in, guys. This is the top 20 most streamed Eurovision songs on Spotify right up to this year, 2023. So number 20 was Chanel with the song Slow Mo in Turin in 2022. No surprise here. It was the most amazing performance on stage live, but also really radio friendly as well. So it doesn't surprise me that this did well after the contest also. Number 19 was Blind Channel with Dark Side, and this was in Rotterdam 2021 such an anthem and this came sixth place in the actual contest this was such a fan favorite at the time and did a really good stage performance um again i'm not surprised that this did well um following the contest in spotify for sure Put your meat up in the south, in the south, your up and don't stop Again, in 2021 in Rotterdam, we had the 18th most streamed song was Barbara Pravi with the song Voila in Rotterdam 2021. This came second place, again, a really good finisher. In number 17, we had Baila Pecados with the song Sergio Dalma, and this was in 1991. Wow, this has 67.6 million streams, and this came fourth place in the actual contest. And number 16 was Lena with Satellite in 2010. She won the whole thing. She did so well. And this has had 73.5 million views. Wow. Satellite was such ahead of its time, I think. And I'm so glad this did so well on the night. Number 15, I love this song so much. Go A with the song Shum. And this was in Rotterdam in 2021. Wow, a lot of songs from Rotterdam 2021 doing really well in the Spotify charts. And this came fifth place. Uh, Go A, of course, represented Ukraine. And I absolutely love this song. Wow, so Michael Schulter, uh, number 14, with You Let Me Walk Alone. And this was in Lisbon in 2018. He came fourth place. Again, an amazing result. And this had 86.1 million views. Another really good result for Germany. Oh, one of my all-time favourites, Eleni Ferreira in number 13 with the song Fuego. And this was in Lisbon in 2018 too. And this has 98.8 million streams, guys. And this was second place. Definitely one of my favourite songs to date, for sure. A most amazing stage performance. Eleni is so talented. Everything about this, the staging, her look, Eleni's performance and the dancers, it was all iconic. And once again in 2018 in Lisbon, we had Netta with the song Toy and this was number 12 and it came first place. It won the whole thing. Of course, Netta represented Israel. I think it was really neck and neck between Eleni Ferreira and Netta uh, at that contest, but Netta took the whole thing. She won it. Wow, okay, number 11 was Franz was if, with If I Was Sorry in 2016. This came fifth place in 2016 in Stockholm. Um, and wow, this has had so many streams. Okay, guys, we're into the top 10. So what is the 10th most streamed song? No surprise here, but wow, this is interesting. So this is uh, Daddy from Iceland, and this is Think About Things in 2020. Unfortunately, this song didn't make it to the live Eurovision stage because of the COVID pandemic. This has had 130 million streams, so I'm so glad it got the recognition it deserved. Number nine in Turin in 2022 was Mahmoud and Blanco with the song Brividi. 
and this was this came sixth place in the contest but had so many streams 131 million wow absolutely love this performance and again one of my favorites number eight monzel malo with the song heroes in 2015 won the whole contest 149 million views and number seven was Lorene with the song Look Euphoria. Oh, it's just banger after banger, isn't it? This is just favourite after favourite. I absolutely love all these songs. Of course, Lorene won with the song Euphoria in 2012 in Baku. If you go and check out my top five favourite Swedish entries, you'll know this is my favourite Swedish song of all time. Wow, number six was Mahmoud again with the song Soldi. Well, wow, Mahmoud has done amazing in the Spotify charts. No surprise there. This was Soldi in 2019 representing Italy and he came second place. Wow, 219 million streams. So catchy. I love that shirt he's got on. Oh, what a classic. Number five was ABBA with the song Waterloo, an all-time favourite. In 1974, this won the whole contest. Another one of my favourites, Alexander Ryback with the song Fairy Tale in Moscow 2009. And this is number four, and this won the whole contest, guys. Wow, I can believe this one. In third place was Monaskin with the song Zitti e Buoni in Rotterdam in 2021. And of course, they won the whole thing there. Monoskin have gone on to do the most amazing things in America. They're super famous here in the UK as well. They performed at Glastonbury Festival this year. And this has had 391 million streams. Wow. And I know they've had some amazing singles as well that have done just as well in the Spotify charts. Wow, so this one's super interesting. Number two, the second most streamed Eurovision song on Spotify right now is Rosa Lynn with the song Snap. That's right, guys. In Turin in 2022, this song came 20th place, guys. So it really didn't do very well in the actual contest, but the song has built its way up the Spotify charts to be the second most streamed song on Spotify. Wow, Rosa Lynn, that is such an achievement. Wow, what a comeback. I absolutely love this song. And we're at number one, guys. The number one most streamed Eurovision song is, of course, Duncan Lawrence with the song Arcade. And this was in Tel Aviv in 2019. And of course, he won the whole contest. Now, guys, that I'm not surprised like that this one at all. So according to this video, this song has had 947 million streams that i can't even process that amount of people it is so many times that's absolutely incredible wow well done to duncan lawrence for writing such an amazing song i know we all love this song arcade it was so impactful on stage and clearly it's gone on to the most amazing accolades following the contest as well in 2019 well done duncan lawrence that was amazing there we have it guys, that was the top 20 most streamed Eurovision songs on Spotify ever up until 2023. That was amazing going through some iconic Eurovision entries. I really enjoyed that and I hope you did too. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button and make sure that your notifications are switched on so you don't miss my next video coming really soon. As always guys, thank you so much for tuning in and I will really look forward to seeing you all next time. Bye guys!